Hurry, hurry, step right up. Sir, you're gonna have to wait your turn. Hey everyone, and welcome to Ultra Tower! With the addition of Beautiful Doom, of course, for good measure. Apparently this is a remake of Tower of Babel where you actually have to scale a big-ass tower. In case it wasn't obvious. I guess we should get get started, huh? This ought to be fun, right? I hope there's something accommodating a pistol start. Oh good, there is. Excellent. Thank you very much. How many secrets? Just one. And there are 101 enemies. So that means there's 100 enemies and a cyber demon. Cool. Wow, this is a big ass tower. For such a big ass tower, you'd think there'd be more enemies in it. Oh well. It's kind of weird. I'm sure it'll. Yep, it's just easing you into it, isn't it? On the plus side, since it's based on Ultimate Doom, and I probably won't have to worry about Revenants and Archviles. And Arachnatrons and Chain Gunners. In fact, the worst I'm probably gonna have to deal with is these freaking Shotgunners. Which, to be fair, are some of the worst. Although, on the plus side, I probably won't be dealing with the Spider Mastermind, either. Because this is E2M8. This isn't the third episode where the Spider Mastermind actually appears. Also, where the hell am I supposed to go? These bars all of a sudden... Oh. They just open up on their own. It was just there to make sure that you can't leave. At least not until uh, a good amount of time has passed just to make sure that you killed them. Yep. Well, okay. You know what? I can just stay on the other side of here. That works. You kind of made the, the bars close a little too slowly. Idiot. No offense, level maker, but maybe you should have thought this through. Maybe you should have made the door close fast. I mean, even Vanilla Doom has that function. Although, you know what, I'm going to go ahead and fight them anyway because I don't want to run. I'm pretty sure this map is going to be short enough as it is. After all, it is based off of Tower of Babel. And there are only 101 enemies in this level. Which means there probably isn't going to be that much of this. No problem. I'm disappointed in you, chump. You know what, I'm just gonna run down here and grab all the stuff that I missed the first time because I was in, I was rushing it. There we go. Is that really the best you got? I'm disappointed in you. You failed. In your mission to stop me, of course. Ooh, I'm already halfway done. At least done with the enemies. I get the feeling it's gonna get it's gonna get heavier the more I do this though. I may as well take my sweet ass time, right? Take this. Oh boy. I'm getting a little surrounded here. This is getting a little pricky. It's okay though. Everything's fine. That's all you got? Pathetic. Truly pathetic. I wonder where the secret is in this level anyway. It's gotta be somewhere, right? Maybe it's some kind of humpable wall somewhere. But then again, who knows? Wait a minute. There's a teleporter down there. That's gotta be something, right? What's this? Wait, what? All that did was take me back down to the bottom. Or is that just a checkpoint? That's cool. It's a nice touch, I'll give you that. I'm probably saving a lot more than I should. But I just want to make sure that I don't have to climb up these unnecessary stairs each time if I die. And that's a big if, though. Oh, okay. Cool. Very cool. Yep. What? They're not even trying to... They're not even trying to lock me in anymore. You know what? I'm just gonna let them fight each other. This, this is more entertaining. 
Entertain me, sucker. Entertain me, douchebag. Take this. This is so fun. Dance for my amusement, chimp! Obviously the Barons would be the big star runners. Take that. You know what, I'll fight this one while you fight that one. Got it, Cacodemon? We're, we're friends. I would never let anything happen to you. Don't worry, we will win this. Cacodemon, where, where'd you go? You probably bailed on me, the prick. Fine, be that way. We were never friends to begin with. I lied. You bailing on me like that? What kind of friend are you? You're probably too weak anyway. Yeah, I said it. What the? Some of these stairs don't even have enemies on them. Then again, it is starting to weed out. It is starting to thin out. Ouch. Hey, no fair. No fair using tactics against me. You can't do that. This is cheating. Only I'm allowed to use cheap ass tactics like that. Haha. <laughs> now it's working against you, isn't it? Thank you, Barons. For being so stupid as to weed out your own enemy, your own group. I really appreciate it. Seriously, you've done far more for me. You've done far more to kill your forces than I ever could. Thanks, pal. Well, that was fun. Unfortunately, I'm looking a little worse for wear here. I may have underestimated my threat quite a little bit. Is that a rocket launcher? Yes, it is. Sweetness. Oh, clever. Now we're getting freaky. Ouch, okay. Missed up. You know what? I'm not gonna waste any more shells and rockets, I mean. I sh wasting shells is exactly what I'm doing right now. But they're not being wasted, of course. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna waste any more rockets on the likes of you. There are only two of you left anyway. One of you. There's only one of you and one of me. Let's Frank, let's be let's be frank, pal. You're uh, you're over, you're outmatched. You'll need a hundred of you to match one of me. It was a mismatch from the beginning. So, this is it, huh? I've killed all hundred of those enemies. Now it's just the cyber demon to go. Let's do this! For Sparta! Oh, what the hell? I see. You have another one. Cool. Very cool. Wait, what's over there? I know this may seem like I'm just dragging out the clock, but seriously, I want to know if there's anything at all. There's a lot of empty space, I see. It's a pretty cool looking tower, all things considered, but... It's mostly just a blank area, to be frank. It's got some trees, so that's pretty nice, but even so. Oh well. No more delays. Let's get to this. That's a long ass elevator. <laughs> then again, this is a big ass tower, ain't it? That's how long it took. That actually took long enough that I managed to whistle the Jeopardy theme. Now we're talking. Yeah, baby, yeah. This is a great big arena. Perfect for me. Bad for you. Since you're immune to splash damage, or at least you're, since you're immune to radiation, radius damage, 
you would do very well in a cramped space. Unfortunately for you, this is not one of those cases. Your radius damage isn't going to do much to me. What do you got, huh? This has actually been a pretty fun map. All things considered. Maybe I should look for another one. That's all you got? All I gotta do is veer slightly to the left. Uh-oh. There we go. Kaboom! Kaboom, mother effer. Kaboom! I may not have found the secret, but who cares? You've done it. The hideous cyber demon lord that ruled the lost Demos ba moon base has been slain and you are triumphant, but where are you? You claim to the edge of the moon and look down to see the awful truth. Demos floats above hell itself. You've never heard of anyone escaping from hell, but you'll make the bastards sorry that they ever heard of you. Quickly, you rappel down to the surface of hell. Now it's on to the final chapter of Doom. Inferno. Inferno. You know what? Now that I've done everything else, I think I want to try to find the secret real quick. Wherever the hell the secret is on this map. Seems kind of weird. Is there a secret? Oh. Let's see. Is the secret somewhere in here? Because that would make sense, wouldn't it? I don't see anything. Why do I get the feeling it's down there somewhere? Oh! Are you kidding me? Why did you... Why did that trigger you to go up, man? Not cool. Deronimo! Get me out. Get me out, Scotty. Beat me up. Alright, I'm gonna look for the secret. Hang tight. So this is the secret, at least I would assume, yep. If you take the time to go all the way around here, you can actually find the BFG. So that's, that's pretty cool. All in all, I'd say, uh, not too bad. I kind of wish the tower wasn't so empty. I mean, there are long stretches of stairway with pretty much nothing in them. It's not that big of a deal because Doom Guy runs insanely fast, but it does make most of the map feel Pretty damn barren, if you, and pardon the pun, pretty barren. But besides that, it, it does a pretty good job in improving over the original in that now you have a grandiose staircase, a grandiose sort of thing to take you to the cyber demon. I almost thought it was gonna crash there. I mean, Blade of Agony crashed every five minutes, so you never know, I easily thought it could've. But anyway. On second thought, it would be quite a shame to end it there, now wouldn't it? Here's another one that attempts to remake the Tower of Babel. Let's see how this one goes. It's promising so far. Well, okay then. Cute. It's very detailed. Already I'm, I'm loving it. It's very much the clear runner the forefront for being the preferred one of the two. That's not to say the other one was terrible, it was just kind of empty. If it had more stuff in it, it would have been better. Well, not better than this, just better than what, better than it ended up being, you know, you know what I mean. Now this is cool. This is already getting me engaged, and it's breaking out a freaking barrel. I don't forget you. This one does not hold me punches. Damn. They are coming in at force. Damn, son. Damn, son. Uh oh. Holy crap. Yeah, maybe I should have saved. Damn. Whoops. This might have been a mistake. Babel remade. <laughs> well, let's try that again, huh? Well, at least it shows you all that it has to offer from the get-go, and anything that isn't immediately visible in front of your face is on the Reveal All Auto map, and it's got three secrets to it. Although it's kind of silly for it to have three secrets. 
That would be a bit anticlimactic. But you know, it's fine. Uh, I'm guessing you have to go through all these bathrooms. Holy crap! It's aggressive. Hey, douchebag. Holy. 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 It's raining demons. They're everywhere. Assholes, shotgunners, as far as I can see. I need to slip out before I die. Oh boy. Douchebag. You're a douchebag, you know that? Screw that. I'm gonna try something else, something that's less killing. Ah. And less making me waste all my freaking ammo by missing. Screw you, sir! Screw you! No! I say screw you, sir! Screw you from here to Timbuktu! Did I not even grab the rocket launcher last time? That was a little careless of me, wasn't it? <laughs> little, I say. I see. So, one way or the other, I'm not getting through until I get something. Oh, look at that. I can actually make it to the other side of this. Not that it matters because it blocks me off on the path. Damn. This is very unfortunate here. But I better just keep shooting. Oh boy. Did I hit the switch? Not that it matters because the lava is going to finish me off if they don't. Very unfortunate, Maine. Okay. Better save right now. Even though I'm pretty sure that's just gonna get me killed. Okay then. Time to face them up. Can't be that bad, right? No, I'm not kidding, it is exactly that bad. restores your health to 100 right off the get-go. Otherwise, that would be even more ridiculous than it already is, you know? Okay, what did that switch even do? That switch got you out of your own stupidity. That's what it did. Clearly, that was a uh, red herring. Doesn't do anything for you, really. I'm still no better off. In fact, in many ways, I'm pretty sure I'm worse. Does that teleporter actually take you somewhere good? I mean, I would actually be willing to jump into it if I thought it would take me somewhere good, but it does not. It just takes you back to where you were before, except now you'll have a little less health because you stupidly jumped in lava. I mean, that's just how the way... That's just how the universe works, isn't it? 
I love what you've done with the place, though. The flesh, the flesh walls on the top side. Mwah! Beautiful. However, I don't really appreciate all the death you've covered the place with. Very unfortunate, you know? At least they give you a lot of rockets. Rocket power. What the? Seriously? Stupid prick? Douche. Hey, would you stop, please? Well, this is the game clearly saying, hey, you might want to take everything you can and then, you know, make room for a couple more because you are screwed otherwise. Now, let's see. Let's try to get out of here. Is it? Oh boy. <laughs> well, that was fun. It's hilarious, actually. Screw you, man. You can't do nothing. No matter what you no matter what you focus on, there's at least five other demons ready to rip your throat out the second you turn your back on them. And it's not like you can avoid turning your back on somebody. He got, they got you surrounded. That's what happens when you get yourself surrounded. Just back to something. Well, I mean, technically I wasn't turning my back to anyone there, but they still kill you. I, I should probably mention that even if you don't turn your back to anyone, you're still going to die. Because they'll just kill you in the front. You think they, you think they care if they hit you in the back or the front? They couldn't care less, son. They will kill you in every every possible orifice, every possible direction, every possible manner, even manners that you didn't think were possible. Oh boy. Well, the barons are going to be the biggest pains in my arse. <laughs> nice. It's awesome. Damn it. If I could just get them to kill each other, that'd be great. But that's not going to happen, is it? Wait. Nope. I just saw something there. Damn it. Here we go. Okay. Good. Thank you. It's just the barons now, I'm pretty sure. Yep. And me. My own stupidity. I probably should have mentioned that. My own stupidity is a factor here. And he's probably even worse than the... Probably a bigger threat to my health than the barons. To be frank. Spider masterminds. I don't know if there were any in this level. Dude, quit dodging my bullets. My rockets, whatever the hell you call them. I don't really care. Quit avoiding my death ammunition. I really don't like it. What the? Okie dokie then. Okie dokie, artichokey. Damn. There we go. Cool. Did that get did that? Oh, I'm actually on a tower. I think it actually took me something. It took me to my death. Wait, I've still got the berserk pack. I just gotta punch him to death. Simple. I'm making this way more complicated than it has to be. Who wants to rush into their death, huh? Take it all, comers, huh? Hurry, hurry, step right up. Sir. You're gonna have to wait your turn! Only one kill at a time, sir. This is the BFG. You'll have to wait your turn, good sire. Good sire. Honestly, these demons are so impatient. Everyone wants to cut line. Well, that's not the way it works. There's a special place in hell for those who keep skipping the line, pal. And that hell is... I probably shouldn't even say. That hell is carnival rides. Drink carnival rides. That's what happens when you skip line. You end up getting to the carnival rides. The very crappy ones. And end up 
being a complete scam and hurting all your money. Is that what you want? Conning and all the games, huh? I love how the health, their health bonuses just make the trick. It's weird. It's kind of funny. It kind of reminds me of that parody Doom mod. Where it's like, ugh, I'm so hurt, I need health. And then a health bonus appears. Not very nice. You know what I do to people who aren't very nice to me? Shoot them with rockets! All rockets all the freaking time, pal! You get a rocket. You get a rocket. Everyone gets a rocket in the face. You know, I wanted rocket power to be about skateboarding, but since you wanted it to be about death, you know what? Why not? Rocket power! One, two, three, four! You are so dead! Rocket power! Prick. What kind of asshole waits for someone and then shoots them right square in the face? Who, I ask you? This prick right here. And maybe me sometimes if I happen to catch them on guard. But that's okay. I'm allowed to do that. I'm the protagonist. The protagonist can do anything he wants. That's the perk of being the protagonist. The doom protagonist. The doom guy. I just feel like I just made a huge mistake. Maybe. Secret? Well, it's hidden in plain sight, I'll tell you that. Very good use of that for sure. Help. Wait, we're in hell. We're gonna lose some weight. See, the pounds are falling already. Good on you. Well, what do you know? That's cool. Is it a... Damn. I want to know what's in the... What's over there? Is there anything over there? Is anything awaiting me over there? That is in the least bit pleasant, because I would like to know. If I can even get over there. I can't go back to back here. Oh, boy. Unfortunately, all that's waiting for me is the timely death. Did you? Great. I'm surprised I've lived this long. I'm gonna borrow time at this point. Yeah, I knew I was gonna die eventually. I mean, it's a cramped space. What the hell did you expect? Did you expect me to live that? You can't expect someone to live that. It's just straight up impossible, sir. <laughs> Problem with that? I mean, I don't have a problem with it. I don't have a problem with it at all. Gladly run. Let's get the hell out of here. Uh oh. Well, it can't be that bad, right? It's just one bear ridden. And a bunch of bad boys. A bunch of pink boys. There's a bunch of pink guys all around, huh? You know what? You get distracted. I want one of you to get distracted. Okay, never mind. Okay. This, this could be working out better. Help. Where the hell are we ending up at? Is the cyber back past there? Oh, he is. Cool. He'll take care of these guys. Cyber. Cyber is always on my side, right? We'll just kill me. You know what?
between me and everyone else, someone's gonna kill somebody. And I don't want to be the one to die. Nice. That was awesome. You know what? Screw it. I'm just gonna use the plasma rifle to kill myself again, so... Okay, I I'll just kill myself, that works too! Okay, screw you, Cyber Cat Demon. Nice. I love when that happens. I love when a plan comes together. Uh -oh. just, just let everyone die. Let everyone fucking die. I don't care how they die as long as they die. See? See? They're relevant because they killed me! Oh boy. Oh boy. This is bad. Very bad. Okay, screw you, Cybe. Screw you, Cybe. Damn it all. Okay, so hang tight real quick. See, I knew I'd do it eventually. I forgot to put the beautiful doom on with this, but given how big this level is, it's probably for the best. Yeah, you've read that before. Well, that is the other Tower of Babel remake. Hope you enjoyed both of them. I must say the second one I like a lot better, even though it was kicking my ass a lot of the time. But you know what? That, that just makes beating it all the more satisfying. And that is it for now. Thank you so much for tuning in with me. Make sure to spread this video around like hell itself and Cyber Demons, and I will see you next time. Now go out there and capitalize on life. Peace out, have a good one, and have a nice and pleasant day. If you enjoyed the content and want to stay up to date, I upload 10 a.m. and 2 p.m. Eastern Standard Time every single day. You can also subscribe and hit the bell icon, or just check out the end screens right here.